dealers, man, Hot uh, Davis, and I'm rocking my dog Serato. You see me just did come to That's a shoot shoe right there. He, look, he ain't come to disappoint you. I'm in disbelief right now. I'm wearing the hot shoe, man. You man, you man. Yes, man. What's going on guys, it's your boy Serato back at you one more time again with a new Naruto piece this time. My guy Jay hit me, told me he needed a Naruto Sasuke piece, you know, kind of standard-ish, but you know, we gotta change it up a little bit, add a little bit, you know, add swag to it, you know, switch up the vibes a little bit and give him something that he hadn't seen yet, so I got something really nice planned, but I wanted to skip a little bit of the boring parts in the beginning, you know, you guys have seen taping a little bit, you know, you kind of know what's going on there, so let's go ahead and jump right into this paint, right into the process of getting the characters on the shoe. I'm working with the Kobe NXT AD 360s, these are the cherry colorway, they're kind of dope, I did these before with my guy Tori. In, so you know they came out pretty cool then i figured it was gonna be pretty cool this time too right and as always this video is brought to you by my guys over at apparel they have the chain gang over there and they hook me up with all my ice um they do a lot of custom pieces for me but you guys can order stuff for yourselves as well just use my code okay it is serato crew and it's right there on the screen for you use my code go to the website there cop some pieces you know be a little bling bling blow on yourself you know what i'm saying grab some but without further ado let's go ahead and hop into the video All right, so as you can see, I've got this all pretty much taped up. I actually forgot that section right there, as you can see, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. Um, but got this all pretty much taped up. All the sections, uh, oh shit, all the sections cut off. Um, just need to wipe this part out here. I'm gonna wipe that Kobe logo out. And uh, that should take us to our next step of adding the porches. Okay, now our whiting is done. It's time to go ahead and add our LK top coat. This is our scratch finisher, our protector, our sealer, and it's gonna allow me to put my pen back on top of this and do my line work. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and grab the stencils and I gotta get my reference material printed off the computer real quick. So I can go ahead and start on the portraits. I'm gonna have to lay a few of these stencils down first before we start painting, that way, you know, the base layer is covered. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and cut these stencils out and start applying them to the shoe. And now for the portraits, starting with the line work. And now I'm gonna go ahead and start masking over my line work here so I can go ahead and do our base coat. Uh, it's gonna be a dark fade across. So I'm gonna make sure I don't get that on anything else. I need a red fade. Then I can go ahead and fill in our Kotsky clouds with some transparent red that I can lay straight over the black and go ahead and start filling in our portrait color.
Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and pull off our logo stencils and go ahead and repeat that process from earlier with some more transparent colors. Then I'm gonna go ahead and mask off everything but this section right here, which is conveniently shaped like a ninja headband. So I figured I might as well make it one. Time to remove our other stencils, take off this masking, and uh, clean up any of the trim, and uh, black out any of the sections around the lacing. I'm also going to add the clan tag to the tongue here, and my man's name to the back of the shoe for a nice little personal touch. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Drop a like, subscribe, tell a friend, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. And make sure to drop in the comments what you want to see, what character, what anime, what show. Let me know. I'm looking for ideas.